At Two Point Hospital, over 52% of our patients believe they leave healthier than when they arrived. Our precisely calibrated equipment is operated by compassionate healthcare practitioners, many of whom have even been to medical school or watched ER. If you suffer from turtle head, let us ease your worries and noggin gently out of your body. Just mm. infection is no laughing matter. Put your trust and oversized shoes in our capable hands. We're building a brighter, safer future, and hardly anything will stand in our way. You deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, new patients, and a new you. Can I go play golf yet? I'm teeing off at three.
This is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. This is Ricky Hawthorne, bringing talk, music and news to the whole of Two Point County. And if you're listening to us from the newly opened hospital, just turn up that volume because nothing drowns out the sound of sick people like the voice of a world-class DJ. Coming up next, 42 hours of music from the background band. Enjoy! You know, I've been humming that tune to myself all week, which is uncanny because I've never heard it before. Or have I? Oh well, more catchy music coming right up.
today. Conditions at the Rotting Hill Hospital are getting worse every day. Apparently, patients are just as likely to die from sinkholes and crumbling ceilings as any diseases. At least that'll keep the queues down. A bigger hospital is a better hospital. Sometimes.
general diagnosis. What a smashing day for a bit of gardening. I mean, who doesn't like gardening? Digging up a bit of soil, sticking your hands in a bit of manure. Oh, I can almost smell it now. No, oh, wait, the sewage pipes burst again. <laughs> no, my mistake. Anyway, keep those fingers green. This advertisement has been removed due to a dispute between Two Point Radio and the producer of Jumbo Nuts. Oh wait, hang on, it shouldn't actually say Jumbo Nuts. Can we do another, can we do another take? Okay, great. This is Two Point Radio.
I went to a holistics nature commune last week to see what they could do about my gravy allergy. They recommended a long stay at their spa and a bottle of rosemary extract. It cost me a month's wages, but I'm finally starting to feel the effects. Still can't eat gravy though. office 
In today's headlines, lottery winner Arthur Compass has announced winning the jackpot hasn't changed him one bit. He made this announcement floating over Krogenbusch in his new gold-plated hovercraft, just like he's always done. and shine everyone and if you happen to be in lower bullocks this morning watch out for the gathering of druids down at Krog Ben's ring in a total coincidence the town will also pay host to a psychology convention today it should all work out nicely
Megan Pass has sent in a very thorough quote for today's nice words of the day. Remember that you are strong and blessed, that to live is to learn, and that all bad things happen for a reason, while good ones come to those who wait. That's a lot of nice words, Megan. the Cheesy Gubbins family. That's too cheesy flavor. Who needs new ideas when you can have more cheese? More cheese? Cheesy Gubbins presents That's Too Cheesy. Ch -ch -ch -cheesy Gubbins. Dare you? 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio.
listening to Nigel Vickleworth on Two Point Radio. Welcome back to your favourite radio station with the vastly overqualified Sir Nigel Bickleworth. I'm here to inform, to entertain, and to bring some small measure of sophistication to your drab little lives. Should any of you have any requests for popular tunes, as I believe people like to call them, do not hesitate to repress that impulse. I have no intention of playing any of that drivel. is apparently going to open another of its nature communes for sick people with more sense than money. Fortunately, I have equal amounts of sense and money.
doctor to psychiatry, please. bring you this segment, Sir Nigel Reviews. Today I take a look at the new fine dining establishment, Les Souffles Tristes. And what a delight for the experienced palate this is. The scrambled emu eggs on pickled toast are particularly good. I give it four salt shakers. Two Point Radio. 
Our reporter on the field, Sally Fig Blanket, has just returned with her camera crew from another field trip. As to what she was reporting on, I cannot say. Nobody tells me anything. Tired of hearing all the good things going on in the world? Sick of cheery headlines and positive articles? Then read the Daily Sneer, because good news is bad news. 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio. Announcement to 
products need routine servicing. If ever you have found yourself at a loss as to the correct usage of the English language, you may enjoy my popular guide to good grammar. A public service I perform with no shortage of humility. I would do one to proper enunciation as well, but I fear your underdeveloped vocal abilities would make this quite impossible. Warm greeting to you all this fine morning, especially those of you in Fluttering, where renovations have been completed on the bridge that leads to the town's ancient castle. Officials say people crossing over will no longer need to wear parachutes and life jackets. Now nah, it just won't be the same. <laughs> 